guys, I'm Sarah Simone Kato and I just had a conversation today with Nathaniel Pete and he runs the Safety Box UK and honestly, it was just so helpful. You know, you want to know these things in school and they don't really teach you that in school. They don't. They don't teach you in school. They just teach you math, science. But we need to know these things like protecting ourselves on these streets because it's not safe all the time. It's not safe. And me and my friends, um, we've actually spoken in school. We've told the teachers and we're, we're telling our teachers that, you know, to have the safety box um, or companies like the safety box to come in and teach us like self-defense or, you know, just skills that we need to no because it's different from back then it's different from when my my mom was growing up when you know the older generation was growing up like it's the youth now and there's a lot more things there's gangs there's county lines there's like just things that you you it, you hear about on the news and sometimes it can happen to you i just believe that we need to have this in schools because they don't teach it in schools so you know, self-defense and keeping safe on the street is so important, especially these days, it's just very important. So we need people like the Safety Box to come in, teach us the safety, teach us how to defend ourselves. So yeah, that's what I believe and it needs to happen. When we saw the video of a young girl being taken away by um, an older man and on it was on her way to school, it just shook everybody, you know. We're seeing this happen, she could barely even scream for help. You know, and it was just really scary, it almost made me want to cry. And loads of my friends were talking about it. If you saw it on Snapchat, everyone's story, you just saw this. Everyone was like, who is this guy? What are we doing? How can we help? Loads of people came to a realization that something needs to be done and people need to look out for each other more. Everyone's asking each other now, are you okay? Has anything happened? And I just believe that this should have been happening before and it's a conversation that just needed to happen. So yeah.